Good evening and welcome to the 5 o'clock news. I'm Pete Ferry. And I'm Riel Creighton. First at 5, an officer involved shooting left a man dead in Vancouver early this morning. Fox 12's Paulina Aguilar joins us now. And Paulina, this is the second officer involved shooting in Vancouver in less than two weeks. What can you tell us about what happened in this case? Yes, it is, Pete. Well, it all started at the McDonald's about a half a mile north from here on Northeast and Dreesen Road. Police say that a group of people flagged down a police officer after they say a man pointed a gun at them. This is the last thing I expected in Vancouver. It's really crazy out here. Police say they found the suspect just south of that McDonald's. The suspect didn't comply with police, and that's when they released a canine. We spoke with a neighbor who says he heard the commotion. We heard some gunshots in the middle of the woods after hearing the PA system coming off from the cops. We started out hearing sirens. I didn't actually see anything, but uh, all my friends started to flee towards the area. Police say the suspect pointed a gun at them, and that's when four officers opened fire, shooting the suspect. It's pretty messed up. They, uh, everyone, then we heard gunshots, like someone's going to get shot, and then pop, pop, pop multiple rounds. Officers gave him medical aid, but the suspect died at the hospital. Less than 10 days ago, another man was shot near the Vancouver waterfront. Police say a man waved a firearm at them and officers opened fire. They provided CPR, but he died at the scene. William just moved to Vancouver from Arizona and is shocked this much violence has happened. Like I didn't expect that in Vancouver of all places. I kind of went up, left home to get away from all that for a little bit. Now, the K-9 was shot in the tail, but was taken to a veterinary hospital for surgery and is expected to survive. As far as, the, as, far as those four officers, they are on leave as standard protocol as this remains under investigation. Reporting in Vancouver, Pauline Aguilar, Fox 12 Oregon.